Lavinia Fontana was recognised as the first professional female painter in Europe, which was an extraordinary feat at the time. She was accepted into the Rome Academy for Painters, which was also a huge breakthrough for a female artist of that generation as well. So in many ways throughout her career, she was just an absolute trailblazer. Melbourne is the only encyclopedic collection really in our part of the world. So we have a real responsibility to make sure that when we're going through all our suites of galleries, that we're ensuring that female representation is a part of that, that value system that we now impose into all of our galleries. So to have Lavinia in one of our earliest galleries in the building is, is vital and highly coveted. So we're very proud. The acquisition of this fabulous painting will highlight the importance of women painters. She's also the earliest painting by a woman now to enter any museum in Australia, and certainly the NGV. And it will sit hopefully alongside her main tutor, her father, Prospero Fontana, and we at Felton Request acquired one of his paintings in 1961. So father and daughter will meet up again after 400 years. The NGV's acquisition of our Lavinia Fontana painting was the inspiration for our new year-long online seminar series, Observations. Observations is a landmark event for the NGV, which celebrates our recent collecting of works by historical women artists. And it's really a unique chance for our audiences to learn about new research and scholarship about artists they can see on the walls of our galleries every day. It's an absolute gem. It is incredibly detailed. It's structured at the top left, almost like a da Vinci, because he was one of the influences on Lavinia. In fact, I go so far as to say, I believe this will be the da Vinci of the NGV.